Hey guys and welcome to this tutorial. In this video today we're going to be creating a mixed media piece um, inspired by Turner, John Virtue and Stephen Wilkshire. This is part of the Year 10 GCSE coursework and we wanted them to try something a little bit different and a collaborative piece. So let's get started on the Turner background. So what you'll need for this is A3 cartridge paper, some water, a paintbrush, watercolours, charcoal and a fine liner or a biro. So the colours I'll be using today is this dark yellow colour in the palette, the range of blues and the range of ruddy browns. So the technique I'm going to be using today to get the Turner inspired background is wet on wet. So I'm going to first apply some water to the background and then placing dots of paint over the top. I'm using sort of wishy-washy motions and blending all of the colours together to create the romantic effect that all Turner's backgrounds have. Keep going blending in the mix of colours, making sure that you haven't got any harsh lines and that they're all kind of going into one another. Once you've done the whole background, make sure it's completely dry before starting the John Virtue mid-ground. So for this I'm just taking a picture that I took when I was on a trip in London for reference and I'm using charcoal just to sketch it out. Once I'm happy that I have all my favourite elements in the picture, I'm going to fill it in a little bit more and then I'm going to blend it with my finger to create that smoky eerie effect that John Virtue's pieces have. I'm going over it again to create a bit more depth and colour but I'm trying not to put too much detail in as his images don't have high amounts of detail. Once you're happy with your mid ground you may want to spray it with some hairspray to stop the charcoal from smudging but once you've done that the mid ground's done so we're going to move on to the foreground which is inspired by Stephen Wilkshire. You're going to do really rough sketchy one line motions for this. You can use either a biro or a fine liner whatever you like. Um, I'm just doing really, really sketchy, fast movements. Up close, this looks really messy, but from far away, you can really see the detail and it kind of gives it a really nice look. Stephen Wilkshire's work is very detailed, but try your best to get as much detail in there as you can. So that's it, guys. You've created a mixed media piece using watercolours, charcoal and fine liners or biro inspired by three very different artists who have very different themes and techniques hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks guys for watching and i hope to see you all again soon